Hello everyone and I welcome you to the gospel with Ishmael. Listen very well here. Everybody please pay attention. I don't care whether you're going through it right now or not. I just, this is actually even a message for everybody. But as it resonates with you, it is talking directly to you. That's why I'm even making this video right now. Please note what I'm about to say about your mother. About your mother. Let me tell you something. The Lord wants to do something great and the Lord has not made a mistake with you. And let me tell you that it is easy to look at your mother or let me generalize this and say to blame your parents. But listen very carefully. When it came to David, he wanted to build a temple for the Lord. But the Lord said, I will build my temple through your child. You have shed so many blood in your lifetime. So I'm going to build a temple through your son, Solomon. Listen to this here. The fact that your mother is your mother, no matter, or your parent, sometimes it is hard. You, When we're growing up, we wish maybe we were born in rich families and all this is an example, of course. It is easy to wish why and all these things. Our parents, maybe without knowing God, they take us to places when we're still young and all. There are some things which you wish only if my parents did this. If my parents, there are some initiations. Let's listen. There are different things. But the Lord says, the reason now that you know him, it is was all because he wants to use you. He wants to, you are to be the deliverer for that family. The prayers that your mother made for a better life and all, he's going to fulfill them through you. As much as your mother, your parents, your father, they prayed that may God, may you deliver us from poverty, may you deliver us from what and what, through you. Like how he told David, through your son, I will build a temple, not through you. There are some prayers, they are working not because you personally prayed, but because your mother prayed for you before. And listen very carefully. The Lord says, do not resent, do not regret. Now focus on the you now and he's going to hear your prayers as you pray and it's going to be fulfilled through you. I bless you right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Receive your breakthroughs. Receive all the good things your parents ever prayed for concerning you and your family in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And I'll see you next time. My details are on the comment section below.